What's up guys, Keenan here with Black Market Performance. Um, today I'm gonna to be going over one of our new products that we've been developing for, man, probably the last year and a half. Um, it's taken a lot to you know get it done and get to this point. Um, but it's actually a CSP DSP5 switch that plugs into the OBD2 adapter so there's no drilling, um, anything like that. Super easy install. And the best part is it comes with a mobile app. A mobile app is optional. If you just wanna run the switch, you don't have to run it, but it's always there as an option in the app store. Um, with our app, you can monitor up to 100 PIDs, coolant temp, EGTs, um, clear trouble codes. It's really sweet software. It also probably has the fastest connectivity on the market. Um, your phone, you don't have to connect to it. Your Bluetooth just has to be on. So as soon as you open the app, it's ready to go. So. If you're hopping in your truck, it comes with a sweet foam mount that has our name on it, all that stuff. Um, yeah, you hop in the truck, it's already connected, ready to go. You open the app, you know, pop it in your phone holder, and yeah, you're ready to monitor everything. All right, guys, I'm going to roughly show you the app. I'll connect to the truck here in a minute, just to give you guys an idea. So you got your dashboard, um, which is this, you know, swipe over and change all these layouts. To change the actual PID, you hold it down. You can go through and you can select, you know, tons of PIDs. Um, we have some common specific ones on the bottom, EGR, fuel roll pressure, turbo boost, uh, got EGTs. So you just select whatever you want to monitor. We'll do fuel roll pressure. Click that. There's a little check mark. Push done. And that's changed the fuel roll pressure. Got a bunch of different layouts. Got heads up display gauge. It's just one single gauge. Um, plotting. So if you want to do some data logging, stuff like that, you can do that. You can change these, swipe back over. Diagnostics. So if you have any trouble codes, I'll let you know. You can clear them. Um, let's see what else we got. So fuel economy. We have a dash cam, which is really sweet. Um, zero to 60 timer. Show you guys the dash cam real quick. You can record and you can monitor um, anything you want on there while it's recording that will actually show up in the video. You know, watch your EGTs, stuff like that, drag racing, you can see your 0 to 60s. Go back, you just swipe over, go back to dashboard, you're right back here. Works, you know, either way, vertically, um, horizontal, either way. Um, and then settings, you can actually add any PID that you want that you can find. Change the OBD2 protocol, multiple ECU support, um, sensor logging. Yeah, just all the settings are in this uh, option right there. Yeah, I'll uh, hook it up to the truck. We're going to hook it up to our regular cab that we built. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there show you guys how to use it. All right, so on the box, um, you flip around, you can scan this on your phone. It'll direct you to our website, which has a app download link. So you can download the app on the App Store. This will be available for Apple and Android. Um, we're going to pop this thing open and install it real quick. You do have to run a single wire um, from the OBD2 port, which is included. Um, it runs to the CCV port on your valve cover, and that's actually how you change everything on the fly. All right, here's the adapter out of the case. Um, has LED lights indicating which power level you're on. Yeah, we'll plug this in, and uh, yeah, we'll show you how to connect the app. All right, you can see it's plugged in. Right now, we're on tune number one. And like I said, this is just, uh, we got a little wire hanging right here, but that's actually what you run through the firewall to the CCV uh, plug on the valve cover. I can show you that here in a sec. All right, guys, yeah, that's it right there. Comes with that connector, plugs right into the CCV port. Uh, you have to unplug it from the valve cover. We'll make a thorough video installing this. That actually runs the pin number eight in the OPD2 port. Um, yeah, we'll make a more detailed install instruction. This is just an overview of the new product. All right, now that everything's installed, I'm gonna show you how to connect the app. It's really simple. You can just turn the key on or you can start the truck. Uh, I'll just turn it on just because I'm gonna show you guys. So I have everything killed, just show you guys how uh, fast it connects. So initializing, searching, connecting, scanning, and it's connected. So right now the truck's off, so it's only gonna show, you know, the coolant temp, stuff like that. I can start it up. 
All right, yeah. You can see got our RPM, fuel oil pressure, battery voltage, coolant temp. So yeah, the app works really well, really high speed, um, really responsive. I uh, will come down here, show you the switch function, just the different colors. So that's level two, level three, level four, and then level five, which is normally, you know, the race tune. Um, it's really not hard to reach down here and switch these. You just, you know, if you're not looking at it, you just count one, two, three, four, back on one. Um, it's just really nice if you don't want to drill any holes in your dash. And also if you want an app where you can monitor all your PIDs. Hope you guys like this quick overview video of the new black market performance OBD2 adapter with the live spec monitoring app. Um, this should be shipping within uh, 30 to 60 days. We should have them all ready to go. Today is June 6, 2021. But watch for it, guys. I'm excited to release this. You know, I appreciate all the support you guys give us. And, yeah, we'll catch you guys on the next one.